what is going on guys and today we're going to be talking about the new chrome bit so google decided to partner up with asus and create something called the chrome bit and the chrome bit is basically a flash drive sized usb port so basically you could turn any display into a full computer with the chrome bit so it is smaller than a candy bar it could fit in the palm of your hand this device is powered by a rock chip 3288 processor which is pretty decent comes with two gigs of built-in ram which is nice it also has 16 gigs of internal storage, which I would like to see more. Hopefully, they're, you're able to upgrade in the future. But for right now, there's only the one model of 16 gigs. You get built-in Wi-Fi, which is 802.11 AC. You get Bluetooth 4.0, which is actually kind of nice. So you can set up a keyboard and mouse. Uh, it comes pre-installed with Chrome OS. And it just basically is a really cool device. Like Google is trying to change the industry and make it so basically you can have a TV in your living room, a TV into your house. So if you want to go from, you know, your computer des desktop monitor and then bring it downstairs to your living room or wherever it is, you can kind of move your PC around, which is a kind of awesome idea. I like the take on it. I just feel like they need to do a little more improvements. Like the first model isn't going to be the best one. I understand that. But they need to make it with more internal storage because 16 gigs of internal storage isn't that much. You can't store a lot of videos or a lot of pictures. You can store a decent amount of music, but you're going to fill it up really quickly, which I really don't like. And um, another thing that I would like to see, too, is more RAM. I know two gigs of RAM, I know, in a little stick like this is a lot. But I've they're putting you know almost three to four in smartphones now. Well, I, the most I've seen on a smartphone is three, but you know in the future they're gonna put four. But they put two in this, so I, I'm just trying to figure out you know why they're going so low on the specs. I know they're trying to keep the price down to a hundred dollars, but I feel like they should make you know price points, so you know low, medium, or you know high performance kind of thing. I'd like that to see that. Um, so this is basically my review on the Asus Chromebook. Let me know what you guys think down below, and don't forget to check out the Asus Chromebook. Chrome bit, I should say, from Asus and Google. It's only $100. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel to get all the new updates when the new videos come out. Thank you, guys.